हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू पाइथागोरस थ्योरम बाय डूइंग वन एक्टिविटी एंड विद द हेल्प ऑफ वन मॉडल सो अगेन वी रिक्वायर योर थर्मोकोल शीट्स थम पेन्स कटर पेंसिल स्केच पेन फेविकॉल सीजर स्केल्स एंड थ्री और फोर डिफरेंट डिफरेंट शीट्स ऑफ डिफरेंट कलर्स okay so today i'm going to first explain you the activity so that model will be more easier to understand so let me keep this model aside and we will start with the activity so for that you need to take one base sheet this is my sheet okay so here i have drawn one i have drawn here one triangle uh, the base is b the height is a and this is known as hypotenuse hypotenuse is c the first thing pythagoras theorem is applicable only in right angle triangle you can see that this triangle is right angle triangle if you want you can give name suppose this is p q and r so triangle p q r is a right angle triangle at a point q so what we are supposed to do we are supposed to take the squares why squares because pythagoras theorem says that the square of hypotenuse square means you require one square square of hypotenuse is equal to sum of squares of base and perpendicular so if i have taken b as a base suppose this i have taken as a 3 cm so i will cut one square of 3 cm so my this cut out is ready the square is of 3 cm so, and i will put it here okay similarly here a i have taken 4 cm so i will cut a square with side 4 cm again my this another cut out is also ready so i will put this over here okay and now my hypotenuse i have taken 5 cm so i will cut a square of 5 cm so this is my square is also ready okay so this is the activity for this activity you require two congruent square of blue color two congruent squares of black color and two congruent squares of red color the same one we will stick in the notebook and we will do activity with the another part so i am using the same one over here what we are supposed to do in the second part you pick up this sheet and keep it over here okay first thing you will stick this in the notebook and we we will start with the second set of squares what we are supposed to do here with the second set of squares we will try to arrange this suppose this is your red square you are keeping here with blue square and you need to cut this blue color square so i am going to cut this i have done with the uh, 1 1 cm i have taken this 3 cm so i am taking this 1 1 cm strip and i will try to arrange these strips over here you can see that i have arranged this and still this one part is extra so i am going to cut this one part also the square of 1 cm now you can arrange this here and this one here okay so uh, second part of the activity you need to stick like that so this way we have shown that the square of the hypotenuse red color is one the hypotenuse square of hypotenuse is equal to sum of square of perpendicular square plus base square base also we have arranged so the sum of these two sum of a and a square and sum of b square will give you c square so this is the activity we have shown this with the help of activity now the same thing we can make model for the math slab so again i have taken here two thermocol sheet one thermocol sheet i have stick on another thermocol sheet and the upper one thermocol sheet again i have made there one triangle abc you can see that a b and c with this a i have made here one a square okay with the help of c this is c square and this is b so the whole is b square again i have divided this in small small parts so that we can uh, complete the activity so what we are supposed to do that just remove this c square from here 
arrange this a square okay pick up the parts from the base and just arrange here this part you can arrange here again this is the small part and this is square the last one square so again with the help of model also you have seen that we have replaced this c square what does it mean this c square is equal to sum of a square and the small small parts these are the parts of b square so c square is equal to sum of a square plus b square that is square square of hypotenuse is equal to square of base and plus square of perpendicular so again the same thing we have done with the model this model we, you can keep it in the maths lab so this is the model and this way we have done activity so once again i am explaining you the pythagoras theorem says the sum uh, hypotenuse square is equal to the sum of squares of base and perpendicular so this is your pythagoras theorem and we have done this pythagoras theorem with the help of activity and with the help of model thank you for watching today's video